Welcome to Summer Awesome Films, I'm Rob. We're going to get all of the toxic waste, which I don't really think I need to help you with because you have the app that will tell you where things are. But uh, I want to start off, I'll do, I'll tell you how to go about it. So basically, we are uh, going to all these locations, right? We have an app, it's like a little sonar thing, uh, and like a an arrow with a down and sometimes there's an up and numbers going uh, that's not distance that's not how far away you are that's depth so below our map there we can see the depth is uh, 52 feet and uh, that's that's what we're going for so you want to go down so right now we're gonna go down five meters so we go down five meters there it is uh, once you get above it that is like get close to the red dot so the red dot doesn't show you how far away things are until you get really close to it. So here's the third one. Number three, all the way up here. Here we go. Going around. It's 12 meters lower than us. So we're going to get down 12 meters and pick this bad boy up. Shazam. So just follow the red dot. Sometimes the red dot will point you towards land. So you have to go around. But I'm um, just following my maps here. My little, uh, my little sneak peek with the map telling you where it is and we can go pick it up. There are 30 of these, there is a lot. Not as many, like, after doing the 50 collectibles, 30, I was like, hell yeah, 30, that's fantastic. That is, I'm down with that. That is not as long as 50. So, here we go, number five, all the way up here. These are really far apart as well. At some point, I'm going to get to a certain uh, section, uh, and my ship gets destroyed. So then we're going to start back at the dock. And work our way. So right now we're going clockwise around the shores and picking all these ones up. So these ones are all clockwise. Uh, then when we get to the other side, my little ship stopped working and I drowned. So I go back to the dock and then we're anti-clockwise. And it doesn't really matter. Once you get to the point where I get up to and stop getting them, uh, the last few are about the same distance anyway. In fact, it's probably quicker to go anti-clockwise to start again. So number six, just down here. Some of them are really deep, like this one is really deep. Now uh, some of them are even deeper than this. Actually, I think this one's probably one of the deepest ones. So you're gonna want to have to watch out that you don't get crushed, that you minimize the amount of time you're taking, uh, so your little submarine doesn't get crushed. Unlike me, first time. So look, we're approaching. Cru what's that? Crush depth. I thought they said crust. I was like crust. No crush depth. So right now our sub is getting smashed about. You can see my little engine oxygen tank thingies have kind of been crumpled and squished. So there's number 7 to 30. We are on a roll. I haven't explored up here right now. It's all a blur. So another one. This one is deep as well. These ones are real deep. There's a UFO around here too. If you find it, keep an eye out for it. A sneaky UFO. Keep going down. It can be kind of annoying that you just got to slowly sink down all the time chugga 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 there it is especially in these like tight gaps otherwise i'd point my uh i'd tip my nose down and dive oh this one is a deep one pick it up don't get crushed head up all right next one just over here working our way around i like the submarine i would say i enjoy cruising around in the submarine it's quite beautiful under the ocean I I wonder, there must be all kinds of crazy shit hidden down here. Where's this one? This one's on the other side of this rock. Damn rock. Not here. Keep spinning. Should be just around here. This one's not so deep. There it is. Damn toxic waste. You know it's toxic because it's glowing. If that doesn't tell you something's toxic, then I don't know what it does. But then again, I know all the collectibles glow, so... I think it's just there. Just a coincidence. In the tunnel. Or archway. I suppose it's a tunnel. Underwater tunnel. We're going through the underwater tunnel. Picking the number 10 up. We're a third of the way there. That only took us like 5 minutes. It actually probably took you like 2 hours to get those ones. Cruising around here. Because god damn this thing is slow. Though, you know. Uh, if you happen to buy a cargo bob. You can, you know, pick it up. And fly it over to where you want to drop it. And that makes things much quicker. There's a little little sneaky little inlet here. If you haven't uncovered it yet. 
We're going to go in there and get number 12. And uh, 13 is like right next to it. So we're going to get 12 and 13 pretty pretty quickly here. So cruise on down. Da -da 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 -da. These ones aren't very deep, so they're fine. It's nice and shallow here. Number 13 is just up from this one. Just over here. Whoop, going too far. Turn left, turn left. And now we go down 10 meters. We went way too far. Went off course. Oh, we hit the surface. Go down. There it is. Go over there. Go. Chugga, 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 chugga. There is number 13. Number 14. We are on the other side now. So now we've swapped over. We've gone. So after 13, we left our little sub. He got destroyed. So we went back to the docks. And now we're going anti-clockwise from the docks. And we're going to go that way. Uh, it takes about... It's probably quicker to do this. Because the last couple are like... Oh, fair way away from where 13 was. Uh, so... I'd say go this way. You'll collect more. It's quicker. Just do this thing. That's, that's 13 and 14. I mean 14 and 15. We're getting 15 now. Chugga chugga. Where is this one? This one is up. Must be on a ledge or something. Rising on up. There it is. Sneaky. Very sneaky. Pick it up. We're really deep here. So these, these first ones are really deep. So if you were going the other way, and these were the last ones you were getting, your submarine would be in very... Especially if you went from the start and went and get them, got them all, your submarine would be really pushing it to be together. Unless you're a really good driver of this thing and haven't hit anything and avoided getting crushed at all. But if not, whatevs. Number 16. I think my sub at the end of this gets really badly damaged and I take a... In these parts, I kind of like cruise around, bang stuff, or whatever. But then I think by the end, my sub is really messed up in those last few. So I really take it as gently as possible. Because right now, my sub is a beast. Look how good it is. Ooh, we hit something. And uh, number 17, we are almost done. We're so close. We're over halfway now. Number 18, just out here. Opposite Fort Zancudo. Gonna go here. Cha-ching. Should be just up here. It's really murky around here. Really difficult to see. So make sure you rely on your sonar. Your Tracker Fire app. And the depth. And there it is. Number 18. Number 19. This is another deep one. We're going out here. Not too far from the other one. So just opposite the roads there. So let's go. Let's cruise. This one is about... 400 and this one's a deep one this one's really deep oh wait not 400 Ugh. idiot it's like 70 or something or 80 where did I get 400 from I don't even know what I'm doing anymore text is so tiny I can't read it alright so we should just be there it is cruise on over there boom 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 my sub gets really damaged here because I can't get the friggin thing it's a difficult one to get squeeze in there you can do it. Get in there. There we go. That was a tricky one. That's 19. Number 20. There's an ammunition and a little dock thing there. Ah, oh, we're going to go from there. And cruise on down. It's not very deep, this one. Should be just around here. There it is. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, see, see what I mean? Terrible at this thing. Careless. Careless would be the word. I'm careless with my submarine. Until it's badly damaged, and then in which case I try not to hit anything and I take my time. Number 21! Because I don't have a cargo bob, so dropping this bad boy off all the way on the other side of the map is not really an option. I don't have enough money yet to buy one. I thought about it, but then I was like, nah, screw it. We'll just sub it. Sub the whole way. Because I wanted to find stuff as well. I found a hatch. That's about the most exciting thing I found. So we're down here. Way, 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 way down here. Cruise around. Should be coming up any second. There it is, in the seaweed. Number 22. So, like I said, this you can find these yourself. You have your app. That is like your... Uh, they're not making it easy for you by putting it on the... Uh, it's pretty easy, but I mean, they're not make, like marking it on the map saying it's right here, go here, like Assassin's Creed style or anything like that. You still have to kind of work for it. So, 
but you're gonna fight them. Like you don't really need a guide for this. But if you do, that's fine. I'm not judging you. I made it for you, so you're welcome. We're just up the pier here. It's like right on the edge of the pier. So we're gonna cruise over to the pier. There's the pier. All those little poles and stuff. So it should be there. It is. Thank you for waking up there, toxic waste. Come with me if you. Oh, jackass. Come with me if you want to live. Clearing my, cleaning the oceans one step at a time. I'm environmentally friendly. I'm a, I'm a good dude. The other one, it's just we, we actually passed this one. Now we're gonna backtrack a little bit and pick it up. Skim this one. We, there's not many fish around here. I thought there'd be way more fish. But hey, I'm not, I'm not saying, I'm not. That's not a complaint. I'm just saying I thought there would be more fish, more. More sea life out here. But that's fine. I know limitations and shit. I'm not getting up in your face being like, Oh, it's not enough. You have not made enough for this game. That's nitpicking. That's called being a prick. Right. we got shark followers as well. I don't know why. But now we're on the other side of town here. We're going to get number 26. You can see some kind of wreckage here. Going to cruise around. Go over here. We're going to go. We're about 11 meters above where we want to be. So it should be just over there. There it is. Cruise on down. Now I'm going to take it easy. So this is the point where I'm starting to take it really easy. As you can see, my sub is pretty messed up. And if you can't tell how messed up it is, it is really messed up. Like the left side is all crushed and destroyed. Number 27, not too far from the other one. I'm going to cruise on down. See, look at it. It's mangled. My sub is like one hit away from being destroyed. I'm taking it easy. Get number 27. Then we only got three left. Cruise on down. Boom, boom, boom. Enter the abyss. 14 meters. 12. 11. Take it easy. Easy. As you can see, I'm taking it real easy. Because I don't want to have to drive my submarine all the way back out here. Number 28. Not too far from the other one. Just up here. And then the last two are a little distance away. So now we're descending about 350 meters or so. So get ready for that. Don't go too deep. Though you can't really. I think it ends here. So pick this bad boy up. Don't want to hit the walls. 28. Two left. Now these two, 29 and 30, uh, these ones are over here. So, like I said, if you went from the other ones, the other ones were like the, uh, where we went from 13, the other ones were like way up in the top of the map. So we had to driven all that other space and picked up nothing. Uh, so that's why I went back to the sub base. That and I destroyed my sub. But still, I think it was much quicker to go back there anyway. Even if your sub is alright. I mean, if your sub's fine and you feel like driving that distance, that's fine. But it's a bit of a waste of time, honestly. So, number 29 should be just around here. Right behind us, or in front of us, I mean. To the side, spin around. Must be further ahead, over the hill. Bad submarine. Should be just over this mound, then. There it is. Cruise on down, pick up number 29. And then we got one left, and we get an achievement as well. So, achievements are nice, I think, I guess. If that's the kind of person you are, and they mean something to you, then that's good. Let's get one. Number 30, all the way up here or down here. Depends what way you're looking at it, really. Number 30, yeah, it's not too deep. So it's just on the surface, really. Just barely under the water. You could probably dive and get this one. Right, we're going to pick it up. Let's cruise on down. That's 30. We get an achievement and a lot of money. We made a ton of money. And there's a shark. I wonder if I can hit the shark with my thing. Apparently not. 15 G's waste management because we cleared the toxic, toxic waste and we managed to do that, I guess.